What's up everybody, it's Chu Flock of Backhead again with another Madden YouTube video. Today we have another gameplay. We are going to be using the brand new 93 overall Kenyon Drake. We are 25 Cardinal Steam team mixed with Raiders, but that doesn't matter for now. Anyways, let's get right into it. I'm going to take a quick look at the card before we head into the game. Looking at him, he does not look bad at all. I only have one sprinter because we just switched over to Xbox. Not the most coins right now, but as you can see, we have a 95 speed on him, 93 excel, 93 carrying, all 90 pluses there. The change of direction is even a 91. That's what I love to see. Break tackle, not the highest. His catching at 76 is something I love. That is a high catching for a running back. I'm excited to use this, especially in a Cardinals team team. Let's get right into the gameplay. Starting on offense, let's see if we can get anything going. We run an inside zone there. People still are using inside stuff for that. It was something I was not ready for at all right there. Hopefully, we can get something going. It looks like we will not be able to run any of that this game. I am not a big runner, so as you can see, we're going to have a little bit trouble getting it started. But besides that, let's see if we can get anything going on this trap play next play. The run, uh, Doing running gameplays is a little difficult sometimes. As we break a pretty big one there, that was not bad at all. But doing a run gameplay is a little hard when people are packing the box like this. Like, this dude has literally been, he's opened the, the hole has been literally five people in there every single time. So, it's been a little difficult. Let's see if we can hit him with a cover two beater here, though. It seems like he's running this every single play. But, I have no clue he's using. I'm not really paying attention. He's using Sam Mills here. This might be, a, it could have been a touchdown. I have no clue what he's running at all. We have like a million years in the pocket though right now. Is we're going to just hit A right, I mean X right there, wide open. He's sending two people. Might as well take our play actions there. I have no clue what he's running. Like his, it says he's running a cover two there, but there are four people deep. I don't know if he's audibling it down, but I don't know. This is like the, the defenses nowadays are so different than what you normally would see. But every Kenyon Drake, look, you see a break a tackle there. We're not playing so bad. Three rushes, 20 yards. Not terrible. Not what you want, but still... I, I don't know. Those big plays you can't get with every time. It's it's A lot of it is fluke. So if we can get some plays like that, that is huge. But like I said, you guys saw his catching. He has some really good catching stats. So let's see if we can get him going at all in the passing game. So we're going to dump it down right here. We're going to move there. Oh, let's see if we can. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, 13-yard gain. He has like over 40 yards right now. Not too bad for a fantasy star if you're playing fantasy football at all. I don't know. Like, I'm excited for it. It's a different kind of card. Not a lot of people are going to be using him because it's Kenya Drake. He's not like a big fan favorite or anything. But I'm excited to use him. I've been having a not a bad game so far with him. As he holds on there from a hit stick, too, he has pretty good carry. I'm pretty sure it's 91, I think it said. But like we said, it's this is going to be a this is going to be a really solid card. And for his price, a lot of people are going to have him on their team also, also because of the non-auctionable version. A lot of people will have him. But... Let's see if we can get anything going on offense here in the red zone. My red zone offense has been struggling lately. As we get down on the one-yard line, that is a first down, though. So we have four chances to punch this in. Let's see if we can get anything going. This is this is where I struggle. Like, I'm telling you guys, like, I actually struggle pretty bad here. But Kenyon Drake is going to be here. Let's see if we can uh do, like, I don't know. I want to get him going, but it's going to be hard in the end zone. Let's see what he this guy comes out in. We're going to have Kenyon Drake, and it gets tipped. He was wide open. That was a for sure f uh, touchdown right there. That would have been beautiful. Let's see if we can run the ball in at least now. Maybe we could punch it in in the outside. So I know he has inside stuffer, but if we double team this guy right here, that should be able to help a little bit. But I don't know if it might leave a guy off the edge. We're going to have the outside, but we get tackled. I could have probably bounced it out farther, but I did not like I did not like the speed there. He kind of felt slow because I, I think he was a little tired. The 95 speed probably wins there. That was my mistake. Let's see if we can hit him on a wheel route or anything. We're not going to try to force feed this now. Now we're just going to try to go for the score. But like in these gameplays, I was doing offense and defense. But if the videos got a little long and people come here for the Kenyon Drake video. So, I mean, if I'm going to watch a Kenyon Drake video, I'm going to kind of want to go watch the Kenyon Drake highlights as he drops a pass right there. I don't know. It's, it's kind of hard to find the mixture in between of what you really want to do because... On defense, like, sometimes it could just be dragged out. You could be playing a runner. You could be playing a lot. But, I don't know. In this, you can go watch everything because I'm here to watch Kenyon Drake, you know. 
That's that's how I look at it, at least. As we don't really have anything there, we kind of just throw it in. Let's see. All right, we're going to see if we can get anything going in the next offense session. We didn't look bad. Our red zone offense was just atrocious there. Let's get right back in the offense. We did get an interception. Let's see if we can get any big plays going here on offense now. We're going to run a power here, and we kind of break a tackle there. I was hoping for maybe a block on the end to like hold a little longer. I tried baiting it. That was a hard one to bait. I don't know. It's... Like, the running game, I am not the best rusher, if you guys cannot tell. I am very bad when it comes to running. I do not like running the ball. I probably pass. I probably run the ball, like, six total times when it comes to actual offense. As two people completely miss the guy that I had marked for uh, the mic, that is a tough one to see right there. That was an easy, easy first down. That one is hard to see. Like, plays like that is, like, why I don't run the ball because it's kind of fluky. It's not really – there's no skill involved there. It's more of, like, the, your players just kind of messed up. But this Kenya Drake, I'm telling you guys, he is going to be good. He feels smooth when I run those traps. He's When he gets in the open field, as you can see, I'm kind of forcing the ball to him. That's not what you want to do with your running back. You want to let it just come. But anyways, besides that, he's been feeling really good. As we, he, This dude is literally sending nobody again. We're going to have a wide open B. I don't know why people run that strat. It doesn't really work at all. I don't know. It, I don't know if it's, that's just me, but rushing two people never, ever gets sacked. I've tried it. I've tried to make it work. It literally never works. I don't think I've ever seen it work before. Maybe if you get, like, one lucky, like, I I don't even know. Like, nothing ever works, honestly. But as the trap is starting to get shedded there, our players are just getting tossed around some, like, some ragdolls, our blockers. I, I, I got to start running something else. Maybe a, maybe a stretch here or something. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we can get a stretch going. I'm trying to feed him. Trust me. I'm trying to get this gameplay going with him. It is hard. Like, if you guys have noticed any of my older players, he clicks off there. That's a tough one. To, that's a tough one. The click off, sir. There's nothing you could do there, even if you have, like, a really good player. But, like I said, in the like in the past uh, running back gameplays, it is really, really hard to get clips of them because you're trying to force it. And, I like I show you guys, I show you guys, like, my full game. I don't really force feed anything. As he's not blitzing a single person again, we're going to have him wide open. I have no clue what this guy's doing on defense. His pass defense is really, really weird. It's not even like it's bad, but he's it makes no sense at all because he's not sending anybody. Not really getting any pressure at all, which makes no sense. As we're probably going to get out of bounds here. I don't know if we got out of bounds. We did not. That's actually kind of... I probably should have... I went for the first down more than I went for the... More than I went for like the actual play. Oh, that, that could have been better. I probably could have got out of bounds there. Let's see if we can get anything going on the trap. Maybe punch it in as he's going to get that wrap. That player, I mean, Sam Mills has been really good in the run game against me this game. I don't know. Hopefully, we could punch something in. We need a lucky trap. As we're going to get a wide open touchdown with Kenyon Drake, the trap finally works. We are going to tie this game up. We get the ball at half as well. Let's see if we can get anything going. Let's get right into the next possession. Heading on to the next possession, starting off the second half, we're going to run this RPO, and I thought this would work. We have not been showing anything but trap out of that formation, so that is a great play right there. This Jamal Adams, he has Enforcer on two players, which is something you never see in Madden anymore. So I'm kind of scared. It feels like I'm going to fumble, but he hasn't really forced anything yet. I'm not, I wouldn't be surprised if it comes here soon, but he runs the guest run there. I probably should have ran the read option, but we have 12 rushes, 41 yards, not the best stats at all, but he has a touchdown. But, like I said, there's been a lot of times, like, he knows it's coming. That's the only thing that's hard. So, I got to try to get him involved in other ways. I did not activate his X Factor. I completely forgot. But, let's see if we can get him going on a seam here as we do. I could have probably catch and ran. But, you never know with Madden. We're going to take our nice little 20-yard gain, something like that. Not too bad at all. Let's see if we can run the same play and hit him with an RPO. He might not be ready for this at all because he guessed run last time. As he's not going to guess run now, we're going to have a little bit of time to move. Takes another hit stick. That Jamal is laying down the boom stick on us right now. I don't know. I don't know. He just, he's not fumbling. He's not tired at all. This is a great sign of a good card. I don't know. And plus, in the Cardinal Seam team, really good. Very popular theme team as well. So I think I might be seeing this card a lot as he mans him up, but we have a wide open Amari Cooper anyways. He's starting to man up. He's getting really scared of the Kenya Drake. The Kenya Drake is drawing double teams now. This is looking very, very good on offense. We're just driving as he's finally tired now. Let's see if we can hit him with a play action here. This might work on a guess run. No guess run here, but I have no clue what was going on there with Chad Johnson. He was literally jogging his route, but... 
we're not doing too bad. Let's take a timeout here. I think this might not be worth it, but we are going for the gameplay versus the win. So let's see if we can get Kenyon Drake going at all because he was tired there. I don't want to have – I don't even have a backup running back because I told you guys I have a no-money spend account. So I want to see if this Kenyon Drake can do anything in offense. Now, as he's literally leaving these plays open every single play. Like, he's begging me not to take it. But I don't know. He's more – I think he's focusing more on Kenyon Drake than he is anything right now. That is what's killing him. I'm just ready for this guest run again. I'm pretty sure he'll, it's going to be coming here soon. But as we're going to just keep getting, I mean, I'll take these little gains every single time. Three yards every pop. You'll easily, easily be set up for a big play. But I'm going to keep running this RPO until he guest runs. I know he will again. He for sure will here soon. As he's not going to here. As we're going to cut it back inside. But somehow the guy getting blocked tackles us. That is the worst thing in Madden right now. And this is probably the most rushes I've ever had in a Madden game. I'm going to be completely honest. It's 15. But the thing is we're moving the ball. Because normally like I told you guys. I'm really bad at running. So I never get these plays. But let's see if we can get him on a seam again. It looks like he left him unguarded. And we're going to have another Kenyon Drake touchdown on a throw wide open. This has been a really good gameplay for a running back. Although we don't have the most yards, no really big plays. He's moving the ball. We're getting our first downs. We got two touchdowns with him. Not a bad gameplay so far. Let's see if we get another possession in this game. Just picked off the ball again. I want to see if he quits here. We got another interception. He went for it on his own 13. The pick was out of bounds, so really we didn't get a pick. But as you can see here, we got another big stop. Let's see if we can punch in with Kenyon Drake again. I'm surprised he did not guess run there, but another solid five-yard gain. He is he's bursting through the holes. It's 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 looking really good. Let's see if we can get anything else going. Maybe a Maybe a counter here. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not a big runner. I know a lot of people don't like running the ball, but they still like to watch the running back game plays. That is exactly how I am because I hate running the ball. But I'm having a lot of fun with this card. He is actually really fun as we com get completely nowhere there. The counter is not the best play at all. I do not suggest anybody runs a counter. I don't know. I mean, I've seen it kill me sometimes, but then again, it was like some of the worst plays of all time that I've seen it kill me in. So... Let's see if we can get anything going on this play now. It seems like he's going to be watching that Kenyon Drake. We're going to have a wide open scramble here. Let's go out on the one yard line. I want Kenyon Drake to rush this in. I know this is probably a very, very bad idea, but, you know, I'm kind of getting desperate for this Kenyon Drake to get a touchdown. We need a three touchdown performance from him. We could have put the game on ice right there. Hopefully, we don't fumble or anything. He comes out and field goal protect. Oh, this is not looking good at all. Let's double team him. I know he has inside stuff. I know we're probably not going to score here because he's in field goal block. But let's see. Let's see. Maybe, maybe something. We still end up scoring our third touchdown on a field goal block. On a, We just ran an inside zone there at the fullback. Not too bad at all to finish the game and finally make him quit. Not a bad game at all. Three touchdowns for Kenyon Drake. Had over 60 yards rushing. He had uh, probably like 50 yards receiving. Without his uh, receiving ability, I forgot to activate. A great gameplay. A fun one as well. I had a lot of fun recording this one. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Tomorrow we're going to be doing our top 10 cornerbacks. That will be coming out tomorrow at some time. But anyways, I hope you guys check that one out as well. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.